We're in Kubao Mall. Kubao Mall. And we're going to Yellow Cab. Some of you claimed it to be the best pizza in the Philippines. The best pizza. If you guys haven't seen our Pizza Mont Monte video on Facebook, go check that out. That one so far is the best. It is. It was better than Pizza Hut. It was better than Papa John's. We haven't had Domino's yet. We haven't? No. We've only had a few places, so. But it's the best we've seen so far. But now we have to go through all of these stories and find Yellow Cab. Hey, very epic. Look at that, we found it. Is this a cab company or for pizza? Taxi, taxi. Taxi, oh, just go in there and ask what for a the taxi. Frack? There's a Snap Fitness? What the frack? That's very unfortunate for us. Well, let's eat pizza. Okay, pasta, shrimp alfredo, shrimp aglio olio. They have a New York style hot dogs. Well, we got a lot of stuff, we will see what we can get. Open 24-7. Yellow okay. We just ordered a lot of food. A pizza, a hot dog, potato wedges, ice cream. Lemon tart and drinks. Let's go, baby. That's a lot. But what would a tri video be without a ridiculous amount of food? A lame video. And we're gonna eat it frack and all, baby. Oh yeah. <laughs> It's only a medium pizza. It says it's for three to four people, but we down large pizzas like it's no one's business. And then it also said the, uh, like the dogs are for one people and then the wedges for one people. Oh, that's easy. We're big biscuit boys. Whoa, they have Mountain Dew here? Mountain Dew? Oh my gosh, so modern. Huh? What'd you say? I said, oh my gosh, so modern. Uh. Yellow cow. Lemon tart. Nice wings. A pizza hot dog. Wow, that looks impressive. That looks really impressive. I once had a pizza wow. hot dog of my own. That looks pretty good. In Slovenia. It did not look like this. It was inside of a pizza. Oh my gosh. SB19 endorsed? SB19 endorsed? What? Alright, let's do epic montage of pouring drinks. Ooh, crispy. Will it overflow? Don't you stop pouring. Wow, that is majestic. Epic. Yellow Cab has this down to a science. They put the perfect amount of ice in there to fill the can perfectly. Thank you, Yellow Cab. Very epic. This one's faster because there's no fizz. Oh, there is fizz. Oh. Oh. Wow. Thank Very you, Yellow Cab. Epic. All right, we got a lot of pizza to try. Are you ready? I'm bloody ready. The cool thing about this pizza is look at how many different flavors we get to try. This one is very all out. There's a lot of weird stuff on there. I'm gonna start with this, pepperoni. Is this New York style? Is that why it's called Yellow Cab? It's bloody NYC. You gotta eat it like a New Yorker. Oh, a New Yorker not, fold, folding the pizza. It's not big enough. We should've got extra large. Nice and cold, I'm sure. That's pretty tasty. That is good. The pepperonis are yummy and spicy. There's not a ton of sauce on there, which I, I kind of enjoy more. And the crust is nice and crisp. This is the thinnest of pizzas we've gotten so far. Definitely. Now you will dabble in one. Which one do you dab in? Probably gonna stop. Stop. Oh, the meat boy. Meat boy, meat boy, meat boy. That's pretty dab and tastic right there. Oh, it doesn't fold all the way. Oh, that's a cheesy mother. That's good. That's good. This is really good. A big greaser on the top, as you can see. It is a big greaser. But it's New York. It's got to be greaser. Hey, I'm walking here. I'm walking here. That's how you get into a New York accent, by the way, if you're not from New York or from the Northeast, I should say. You just say, I'm walking in. I'm walking in. I'm walking in. Mountain Dew taste test. Wow, very epic. Mountain Dew does taste slightly different in the Philippines. It's more citrusy. It's more citrusy. It's more lemony, too. I noticed it has much less sugar than it does in the U.S. In the U.S., they're just like, make it taste like chemicals. And it does. All right, I'm going to go straight in with this. I'm getting the all pineapple. in this Filipino pizza right now. Are you ready? 
that works. This is better. Oh. This is better than the greenwich one. Oh. The pineapples are large, but look at how much whiter they are. They're not as, like, chill your mouth juicy. Yes, it works really well, I guess. I never thought I would like pineapple on pizza because I don't like citrus with cheese or milk stuff generally. But this tastes really yum. It's like just a little added sweetness to the saltiness of the pizza. Is this the best Hawaiian pizza in the Philippines? We'll have to see what Mr. Shakey's says about that in oh, the future. Shakey's? We never got Pizza Hut's Hawaiian pizza. No, we didn't get that either. I think this is the Manhattan Meat Boy or something or Supreme or something. There's a lot of things on there. Hey, I'm walking here, but I'm on Manhattan. Oh, I'm walking here. I'm surprised I actually like, I kind of like the Greenwich pineapple pizza too. Surprised. Okay. So it's got all the same meats that this meat one has. All the meats? But then it's got some veggies on there. Is that the Manhattan? I feel like I'm coming straight out of Manhattan. Coming straight out of Times Square? Hey, I'm walking. <laughs> I feel like we miss, we mix in some Boston. Definitely. Our Northeast, it's just New England, that's our accent. It's, hey. not, it's not New York, it's not Boston, it's New England. I'm walking here. I'm Give walking here. Give me a beer. Hey, hey, it's me. Uh, Mark Wahlberg. Hey, it's me, Mario. Come eat some of my pasta. And now it's gonna turn Italian. Ah, hey, I'm a New York Italian. Italians hey, don't yeah, to talk like this. No. They kind of talk like it is. Uh, oh, they, I think they do, because that's how the Mario talk. <laughs> <laughs> we went to Italy in the Philippines. In the Phil... Amazing. All right. These spicy cheese wedges. How spicy is it gonna be? Hopefully it doesn't kill you. True. Spicy has not been your forte this trip. I don't know why. Here we go. They're not that spicy. There's a tiny little bit of a kick in it. Yeah. Kind of like spicy mayo, it seems like. Oh. But the wedges aren't as soft as I want them to be, but the outside is crispy. That's pretty good. The sauce here it looks really pretty, tasty. pretty solid. Really tasty. And the cheese, there isn't a ton but you can taste it. And it's, it's tingling my mouth a little bit. I'm a little biscuit boy, so I can't handle. Look at the color of our skin. We don't eat spicy things, yay. Um, what do you mean? I eat jalapenos Jal occasionally. Jalapen? Do we get our ice cream? No. Do we have a receipt? No, we never got one, I don't think. Will she ask me for a receipt? Better not. <laughs> ice cream acquired. Okay, she knew what flavor it was, so she must have remembered. The hot dog, the pizza dog, maybe? That was tasty. Nice cross section. Ooh. Oh, that's a big bite. It's a big bite for the biscuit boy. Go oh, all over my fault. <laughs> oh. Very oh, and that one hit me in the knee. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's popping. Popping? Yeah. It looks popping. The, the the meat on top's a bit more subtle, and then the hot dog meat obviously just it, does it taste like a, a New York hot dog? It tastes like when I bite into the hot dog, he's like, hey, I'm a hot dog in here. And oh. he's angry at me. Hey, give me a beer. <laughs> you can take a nice biter out of the lemon tart. Why does it look like marshmallow? Uh, like, oh, it is fried marshmallow. Marshmallow lemon tart? Um, Has it hardened? Yes. Oh. Lemony? Party? Like a sweet party? Yeah. <laughs> are those those are crispy and golden brown marshmallows. They know how to make a s'more. When you're out camping on the, or you go to the the, the old bonfire, that's how you make the s'more. Does it taste like a s'more without the chocolate? Or Honestly, you don't taste the marshmallow at all. That's a very unfortunate for the marshmallow tart. It's just lemon. Alright, I'll try the vanilla bean. I do like vanilla bean a lot. I have a feeling it's gonna be very frozen. Oh my gosh, it's cold. Am I supposed to be twisting it or is this just supposed to pop off? I think it's supposed to pop. Maybe it's not, I'll twist. Wow, this is really, really cold. Oh, did you see it? Oh! Oh, what the? Cracker is this gold. You know what, we'll let the ice melt a little bit. Okay. We'll come back to the ice cream. See you guys when we get the ice cream. Oh my gosh, is that a New Yorker? A sandwich. It's like a hoagie. It's like a, you got. It's like a perfect piece. You got the meats and the veggies. How healthy! 
All right, I'm trying some vanilla bean ice cream from Yellow Bean. Look at how premium this is. It comes in a can. And look at how premium these spoons are. Wow, is that straight from an oak tree? So let's eat some ice cream. I'm lactose intolerant. Wow, that's really hard. That went very well. I claim this as mine, sir. Get a little speck. You're surrendering. This is the tri -fate. Oh, look at this ice cream. That's really weird. It looks like it's like um, freeze dried. Like they threw it in some liquid nitro. Wow, liquid nitro ice cream? I think they probably liquid, liquid nitro did. Liquid nitro? Whoa. I taste the liquid nitro. Really? That's really weird. It's really weird texture. It's not creamy. It's like flaky. Like, sort of like. Uh, Slushy, not slushy, but like, got like little ice chunks in it, or yeah, it's like very. Oh, that's really weird. Look at how weird this is. Why is it like that? This is pretty good. The vanilla bean is really yummy. Gives it a really extra vanilla y flavor, and it's freeze dried. Ow. According to the menu, we ate as much as like five people probably. <laughs> At least five. But we did it. Cause we're big boys. People are like, oh you guys are gonna gain weight, you guys are gonna gain weight. We just weighed ourselves and we both lost weight just right there. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like this past week, like this past like five days since we bought the membership, we've been eating like more unhealthy than ever though. Definitely. Definitely. I drank like a whole liter of Pepsi. No, I started eating eggs in the morning. Hey. It's a little healthier. And then we just ate this. Just devoured it <laughs> with our pizza dog. <laughs> I forgot they had the hot dog. <laughs> but uh, Yellow Cap is good. Very good. I think it's better than everything we've had except for Pizza Monte. The Pizza Monte pizza quality, the crust was very yummy. Just in, in restaurants in general, it's pretty high up there too. Yeah, I'd it really say. is. Yellow Cap has the extra stuff in it that you got you got some more options. The pizza was also very yummy as well. Special meats or the all meats one are really good. I like the ham on the Hawaiian one. It's very tasty. But um I think all the chain restaurants we've tried so far, Yellow Cap, you're killing it, baby. We still have Shakey's, Domino's, Domino's. That might be it. Maybe there's one more that I'm forgetting. We have a few more still left to try until we can make our full best pizza in the Philippines. Who runs the pizza game? We're about to find out next time. Thanks for watching, everybody.